I've been playing a game that has me laughing all the time and keeps me coming back for more. Today we're going to take a look at a game on the Nintendo Switch that is highly addictive and very, very fun. Let's take a look at 88 Heroes for the Nintendo Switch. What's up friends, I am Riff. Could you please hit that like button for me? It will make my month, I promise. So 88 Heroes is a game that came out in October 2017, but this is a game I feel like way too many people missed. The premise for the game is simple. You get 88 heroes to beat the game, which consists of 88 levels. You also get 88 seconds to beat each level before you die. The gameplay itself is pretty simple. It is a pretty straightforward action platformer with just a couple buttons needed to play the game, but that is not what makes the game so fun and so addictive. It's that each one of your heroes, you get hit once, that's it. You die, you don't get another chance, you don't get to use that hero again at all throughout that run of the game. You don't even get a chance to get familiar with that character you just played as, whether you loved them or hated them. Each character is very unique and has its own special moves or abilities. Some of the characters are wonderful and feel great to platform with, and some others are complete, utter garbage and trash, and that makes it a riot. I can honestly say I don't remember the last time I laughed this much playing a video game simply during the gameplay. I would find myself seeing a new character pop up on screen and then trying to figure out how to use the character and while I'm saying that I'm saying this character looks so cool I can't wait to figure him out and before I even finish the sentence I blow myself up trying to figure out the buttons for the character but didn't it make me mad it made me enjoy the game more and find the game hilarious. The game knows exactly what it is doing here. They give you just the right amount of time to never fully get used to your character. So each time you take a stab at the game, you feel like it is a fresh experience, especially with so many friggin' characters. Each time I played the game through, I was like, oh yeah, I totally forgot about this character. Oh, and side note, the Switch version of this game is called the 98 Heroes Edition, so there's a total of 98 different heroes in this game. The game has a few modes like Magnificent 8, Solo, Hate Mode, and 88 Mode, which is the main mode where all your characters are randomized throughout the game, which is how I definitely recommend playing the game. I should probably mention that 88 Heroes controls really well and really precise, which I think is super vital and crucial crucial in a platforming game, so well done here. You can get the game digital or physical, and the game is only $29.99, which this is the perfect price for this. Get your hands on the game. Get ready to try out all these random characters that will keep you laughing, scratching your head, and even spend time mastering some characters that you never thought you would like. My overall experience with 88 Heroes was a wonderful time. We definitely need more video games like this that knows exactly what it's doing and doesn't take itself too seriously. And for $29 and 99 cents they knew exactly where the price point should be for this game which is why i can recommend 88 heroes it is a great game it is a fun time and it's time to get your giggles on all right you guys thank you so much for watching superhero game squad again please like the video and subscribe we are here five days a week we also live stream on tuesdays and thursdays thank you all for being a part of this community we appreciate it we love you guys have a wonderful fantastic day